Hey, just trying to keep my YouTube streak going here. Um, didn't get a chance to do a video in the office today, so we're on our way home and I guess I'm paying attention to the road, but also wanted to make a video to keep the streak alive. So I just wanna kinda talk about the importance of answering your phone. Um, I know this is a this was a problem for me and still is continues to be a problem for me. Um, but I dare say it's probably one of the most important things for your business to keep it going and just keep your reputation alive. So everyone's busy, you know, you're working during the day and it, it never fails. A customer calls or potential customer calls at the worst possible minute and you can't get to your phone or if you do, you're going to be falling off a ladder or something. And so you're like, oh, I'll just call them back when I get home or you decide to call them and it completely messes up your workflow and it takes you a minute to get back into it because we all know how that goes too. So if you do that enough times a day, you're losing a lot of job site time and that's where you make the money. Um, along the lines of if you don't answer the phone and you say you'll wait till later, a lot of times, especially in this business, there's not real, later is later. Like you're getting home at like 7.30, 8 o'clock, sometimes nine o'clock. And a lot of times it's kind of, by the time you shower up, blah, 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 eat dinner, it's 10 o'clock or whatever. And you're like, well, crap, it's too late to call someone now. Um, so, so what's some ways to kind of work around that? Um, what I've been trying to implement is setting aside certain times in my day where I stop, I check emails, answer phone calls, text messages, and just try to get um, caught up on everything there. So a lot of times, like, I'll do probably like a 10 o'clock break. I'll take like literally just 10 minutes. If anyone's called, blah, 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 I'll do all that. And then at the same time at noon, I'll go ahead and do the same thing. Like during my lunch break, I'll answer everybody. And then I like to do one more around like maybe say five o'clock or if I'm gonna end early that day or like at a decent time, not really early, but a decent time then I'll go ahead and just do them right after that on my way home. Another thing is when you're driving, um, if you have a hands-free um, phone system in your car, you can go ahead and while well, you're getting materials, go ahead and make calls. It's tough though, because you have to write stuff down a lot of times, but it is definitely the most important thing. I've heard of lots of guys get a reputation of not answering their phone and it can, can completely kill your reputation, kill your business. And on top of that, if the phone's not ringing, you don't have jobs coming in for the future and you need, you always gotta be looking ahead to your next job. If you're not looking ahead to your next job, well, as soon as these jobs run out, you're gonna be screwed. So that's it's a constant battle and it can be very hard to find a happy medium. Um, ideally, you would have a office person answering all your calls, doing scheduling, that'd be wonderful. Like, dream come true for many guys um, or women. And um, so, I would love to get there at some point. That's what I'm shooting for. I'm hoping next spring I'll be able to do that. I got, um, I'm gonna have someone start doing books part time. So that'll be nice to kind of free up some time there, get some time back uh, for the family at night. But yeah, I just wanted to give a quick little video of the importance of answering your phone a lot. Oh, another thing while I'm rambling on here and hopefully something's valuable coming out of this, but a lot of times I've answered the phone um, and someone's like, you're the first person, I've called like 20 guys, and you're the first person that's actually answered their phone, or even if you don't answer it right that second, when I call them back, they're like, you're the only one that's answered the phone, and that right there, you get the job every single time. Like, if they can't get anyone else, who else is gonna do it? So, you can kind of charge a little extra for that too, like, but you don't rip off the customer, but I'm saying for like all your jobs, your rate can be, if you're a good communication, um, like all this stuff, you, you can charge more because you're worth it. So this can also help you make more money as well. And, but yeah, so hopefully this helps someone just answer your phone, end of the day. No one likes to do it, I hate to do it, everyone hates to do it. Wreck your day, you'd rather just work. A lot of guys, they just wanna do their thing, do the, do the skill, do the craft, and they don't like dealing with customers, and I understand, but like I said, probably the most important thing you can do. So like I said, Hope this helps out. If you watch some of my other videos, hopefully those help out too. Maybe subscribe, give a like, give a thumb down, whatever you think you need. Give a comment. I don't know. Just trying to start something here to help people out. I 
I love talking about business and uh, I happen to have a handyman business and I'd like to help other people start their handyman business too. And even bigger than that, uh, really a lot of these can be for any service business or any business really. Um, a lot of good principles and I don't know, hopefully I can just help a lot of people out. So I think that'll do it for this one and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you.